Hi, my name is Ali Zishan. I'm Technical Marketing Manager at NXP Semiconductors in San Jose, California. Today I'll be talking about the value of NXP Semiconductors as a global commodity logic supplier and the USB 2.0 switch solutions that are available for portable and smartphone applications. A little bit about NXP as a commodity semiconductor supplier. We are the largest volume supplier of commodity logic in the world today. Last year we shipped over 5 billion units and that makes us a number one player when it comes to the volume as well as the market share for the standard logic. The high quality, the high reliability as well as the best in class customer support makes us one of the top suppliers at automotives today. At the same time, we have this ability to fabricate and package our devices at multiple facilities in the world, which enables us to support our customers reliably during the steep ramp ups they may have. Talking about DV42 switch, it is an innovative USB switch, uh, which has about 30% higher bandwidth as compared to the competition today. With the higher bandwidth, customers can achieve higher signal integrity without losing the data that goes through the switch. Unlike most of the competition today, the switch itself can operate at 1.8 volts of supply voltage. With 1.8 volt supply voltage, customers can design the smartphones uh, where the supply voltage is shrinking down to 1.8, if not even 3.3 volts. The smaller package size, um, which is leadless, and the low power consumption of the switch makes it an ideal choice for the smartphones as well as other portable handheld devices. Looking at the product value, like any other analog or USB switch, there are a few parameters which must be considered. Low R on resistance, higher bandwidth, higher ESD protection. Those are some of the parameters which enable the customers to use a switch without worrying about the actual trace length or the design limitations in the actual system. Looking at the primary markets, mobile, portable electronics, uh, handheld and battery operated end systems, we are targeting those markets and mo most of our customers, they are in US or greater China uh, and Korea, which include major OEMs and ODMs. The key values for NXP being an analog switch supplier are the high performance, quality and reliability of switches, the great customer service, and the competitive price and performance when compared with the competition today. In a nutshell, NX3 DV42 is a double pole double throw switch, um, which means the differential USB data signals can be pulled in and then demultiplexed out to either of the two ports based on the status of select pin. The high bandwidth, uh, which is up to 950 megahertz, allows the customers to switch the high speed USB data up to 480 megabits per second with minimum edge and phase distortion. The low channel to channel noise provides a higher isolation in the design um, and these parameters, essentially an eye test pattern, shows the rise and fall times, the amplitude, uh, as well as the phase of differential data signals going through the switch. The on-state resistance of the switch is less than 4 ohms, uh, with the on-state capacitance of uh, typically 6 picofarads. And with these two parameters, we tweak the bandwidth uh, up to 950 megahertz and then meet the USB 2.0 standard. The switch is available in leadless micro pack, uh, which is a 10 pin package with 0.4 millimeter pitch and 0.5 millimeter pitch. Uh, the pin out and footprint of switch is fully compatible to most of the competitors, including Fairchild, Maxim, OnSemi, and TI. Looking at the competition, in detail, the bandwidth is definitely one of the parameters uh, where we are ahead of competition. NXP offers a higher bandwidth of 950 megahertz as compared to Fairchild and OnSemi, uh, which only go up to 750 or 720 megahertz. Looking at the application of uh, 
USB 2.0 switches they are mostly used in today's uh, smartphones as it is shown here um, with the increase in the resolution of LCDs there is a need to store data including pictures address books emails in the external storage medium uh, like SD card flash memory or MMC card in order to control the transfer of data between the external storage and the phone there is a need sometimes to bring in an additional storage controller this additional storage controller uses the same physical USB connector and thereby the data can be demultiplexed from the connector to either of the two controllers using a USB MUX like DB42 a second application is when there is a need to send different types of data like UART for debugging and USB data between the baseband and external controllers through the same common physical connector a USB switch enables the transfer of different types of data like UART or USB based on the status of select pin to evaluate the performance of USB switch NXP offers an evaluation board with different USB ports on that evaluation board for NX3 DV221 can also be used for the performance analysis of NX3 DV42 the idea is one of the type B ports is connected to type A without any USB switch in between and this gives us the ideal switch signals or the data signals going through the path while the second type B connector is connected with both type A on the other side via switch in the path the differential data signals can be routed to any of the type A connectors by using the select pin on the board in that way the engineers can compare the signals going through the switch with the ideal signals going through the path with no switch the board can also be used to look at the USB I test pattern and compare it with the one recommended by the standard Thank you.